At Capcono location in El Geo Maracuet County, David Kipto is busy harvesting groundnuts, a crop he has grown for the last 15 years. Kipto has a 10-acre groundnut farm from which he grows the Manipinta variety of groundnut, which takes between three to four months to mature. He harvests his crop twice a year. Siamba ikiwa mzuri, unapatanga kwenya salasini kwa eka moja. Nikikongoa, tunapatanga ya kwenya kumi. His experience though hasn't been a smooth curve. Mbele ni, ukipika sogoni kitu kama sambili, unayesa nunuliwa kwa kimbo moja na silinki tisaini. Ukisulek, ivike kama kitu kama sasita, sasava, unayesa nunuliwa na sikisti ama seventi. But early last year, things changed for the better when the county government of El Geo Maracuet established a processing facility to enable groundnut farmers like Kipto to take their produce up the value chain. To make peanut butter, the harvested nuts are first dried, then roasted, after which their outer skin is removed before they are finally crushed into this thick pulp. Unajua hii mabuta yetu, tunatengeneza na hakuna kitu ambaye tunaweka hata kitoko. Hata chumbi, atuongezi kitu. Inaesamaleza hata mwaka ine. Bora ikiwa nyumba msuri. Kwa soba uni maputa, nitamu. Hata we ukionja, hutaenda, hutakaa area hii. From a 90 kilogram bag of unprocessed groundnuts, Kipto can make between 8 to 10,000 shillings. But when processed, one bag of ground nuts can yield up to 40,000 shillings worth of peanut butter. If you have processing, Kimbo Moja, and I have to say that you 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 have to Although Kipto is looking to grow his peanut butter venture beyond his locality, lack of certification from the Kenya Bureau of Standards is holding him back. Tunasungusha tu sembu ambaya nachua sisi, lakini kupeleka inche atujapata namna ya kupeleka. Ata mambu ya kuweka iyo kept. Tuko na sita kwa hiyo kwa sababu unachua sisi tuko ni wakulima ambaye vatu ni chanka. Kipto is however not doing this alone as he is in the process of forming a self-help group with other groundnut farmers to enable them boost their bargaining power. Thanks to this processing facility, Kipto says he no longer sells his groundnuts for peanuts as he now enjoys the benefits that come with value addition. Denis Otieno, Smart Farm.